So another thing that we need to talk about is this little jewel that's been, um, how would you say, getting into a little bit of trouble, in my opinion. And everyone who's watching, I hope you guys understand. Oh my god, dude. Did they, so did they reinstate them? Off topic review activity detected. I'm sorry, what? So, okay, gotcha. So they just, they just wanted to delete the, you know, like what, what is this? Um, 14, 8,000, 14,000, 23,000, 21,000, 10,000, 5,000, and 743,000. They want to get rid of all of those reviews that say negative because they, you know, don't like a little bit of pushback from the community. So they're going to go, Steam, please! Um... Okay. Remove pair repair costs or re riot. I will say this, okay. Like there's definitely probably some reviews out there that have like someone's got zero hours in the game and they just review it just because they saw a thing on uh TikTok or on YouTube or something. I can understand that, okay? I can get that. But if you have one hour in the game one hour. I think you should be allowed to write a review if it's a well thought out review. If it's not just like, played one hour, didn't like it. You know, if it's, I played one hour, I can definitely see that there's a huge grind with this game. I don't like, you know, this. I don't like that. I don't even care if it's an, you played an hour four years ago and you're coming back to play an hour today and then you're like, hey, it's the same fucking game. Uh, different, you know, polish, you know? I, I, it, this is so weird to me that they, like, it was almost, like, what is it, almost 100,000 views that they try to get rid of? Like, 80,000? 20, 14, 24, 22, that's 60 right there. 10, that's, like, 80 right there. Another 5. So, like, 90,000 views, or reviews. They just want to... You know, Thanos snap out of existence because they don't like what they're saying. I'm sorry, what? Um, no thanks, my guy. That's a little concerning. So yeah, um, let's just say I'm not happy about it. And, but this just goes to show that like we need you, everyone who put it in a review honestly needs to submit a ticket to Steam and be like, hey, like, this wasn't off topic, don't delete my review because, you know, that's cringe. Um, this kit, this time range has been marked as containing an abnormal set of reviews we believe are largely unrelated to the likelihood uh, that you would enjoy this product. The reviews within this period excluded from the review, skew, review score by review score by default. I'm sorry. Um, no. I, like, uh, it's not unrelated. Gaijin is creating a problem within the game, and community members are fighting back the only way that we can. And then they want to go run to Steam and be like, Mama, Mama, they, they're being mean to me. Please, please, Mama, save me. And then, you know, Mama Steam's just like, Okay, little one. I'll help you, you know? That's so... Yikes. If this doesn't get reverted back, like, I don't... Like, I could understand, yes, there's probably some, like... I'll even say 10,000 of them are people who just, like, jumped a bandwagon and... You know, didn't even play the game, they just, you know... They just kicked it off. Let's... I mean, let's... Let's look. No, 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 no. Read the reviews. 100 hours on, 1,000 plus, two, almost 3,000 hours, 11 hours, Salt a Snail before Revolution. Uh, uh, 900 hours, 200 hours, 
150 hours, almost 900 hours, almost 400 hours, almost 2,000 hours. Like, how are these off topic? I definitely, if you spent over 100 hours in the game, you probably have a feel for, like, the game as, as a whole, you know? Like, hey, this is... Like, uh, yeah, no. I, I hate that so much, dude. Playing this game is like committing to a long-term relationship, except the girl hates you and beats you with a cricket bat. Recommended. <laughs> How is that not off topic? Oh, off topic. Get it out of here, you know? Uh. See, look at this. How could this be a, 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 a not related? Oh, this is May 6th. Okay. Also, review all you cause modifying or nullifying in-game prices. If this game is shut down, no one wins. Uh, true. Well, Gaijin, I don't need... <laughs> well, Gaijin, I don't need you to win. I, or I don't need to win. I just need you to lose. True. True. We win if they lose. That's just, you know, if the game gets shut down, the game's not going to shut down because you got review bombed. Don't even. May 18th. I don't need to leave. I don't want to leave a negative review, but Gaijin is blatant contempt for their own player base forces my hand. War Thunder is a game like no other, with a comprehensive damage system, combined arms, and a variety of beautiful modeled tanks, aircraft, and ships. Unfortunately, unfortunately, this uniqueness has left Gaijin with little real competition over the years. What started off as a free-to-play title has, over time, become less and less free. Gaijin keeps adding nations and vehicles while at the same time increasing their repair costs and lowering the RP SL gain. A premium account isn't even isn't enough to comfortably pro progress in anymore. Now you have also have to buy premium vehicles in every nation. I mean, you don't have to. I mean, but if you want to have fun, it's recommended. But anyway. Yeah, no, I, 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 like how that can't possibly be an off top. Like, look at this. This guy writes an essay longer, you know, than most college students. And you want to say it's off topic? Man. So, uh, yeah, if you got, if your review got deleted or something, I definitely recommend putting in a submit ticket. Um, but yeah. It's it's sad that this is what it's come to. They just want to try and get a cop out, and you know, it's it's like it's like a bank gambling with someone else's money, then losing, and then being like, oh well, government, government, give me a bailout, save me. What? <laughs> Doesn't make sense. Wow. Oh well. So 